Kanye West wrote an entire poem. It's an essay slamming Taylor Swift and her fan base and put it on his Instagram. Kanye West sending a message to the Swifties as he believes Taylor Swift's fans are plotting to block his music on the charts. After claims that Taylor Swift had Kanye removed from the Super Bowl, he's once again taken to social media to directly attack her and Swifties are claiming that it was extremely rude, like a demon, and a horrible look for a man who was once considered to be the most influential rapper in the world. Excuse me, was you saying something? Uh-uh, you can't tell me nothing. Kanye took it to Instagram, posting a screenshot of a Taylor Swift fan who told her followers to keep streaming a certain song that would keep Kanye West out of the top of the charts. To which Kanye got extremely offended and wrote a complete essay targeting Taylor Swift and her fans, saying the following. It's just a lot of a lot. When I said that I'm the new Jesus, bitch, I wasn't even thinking about Taylor Swift. That was a whole line before, but I appreciate the free promo. Lil Wayne actually mentions Travis Kelsey on Vultures 2. This album is extremely super positive and fun and it's all about triumphant. It literally breaks the internet. So what are we getting all of the rest of the time? He then admitted, remember I was on Taylor's side when Scooter bought her masters behind her back? She and Beyonce are big inspirations to all of us musicians and we always say how both sell out tours and movies. But then he fired a little bit at the Swifties saying, also I'm sure I've been far more helpful to Taylor Taylor Swift's career than harmful. To all Taylor Swift fans, I am not your enemy. Um, I'm not your friend either though, lol. Just place a thought out there that everyone's not thinking sometimes. 2023, the year in which he was canceled for a string of vile anti-Semitic remarks before being banned from most social media sites was apparently incredibly challenging for Kanye, for his wife, his children, his friends, and his family. I'm sure it was Kanye, I'm sure it was. The post continued as he said, I've been banned from hotels, kicked out of companies, and even not allowed to eat in some certain restaurants. Everyone saw vultures get taken off of platforms to limit our first week numbers. And then he added on that this reminds him of the mistreatment of his people because of the color of his skin. So Kanye can't stand the Swifties, and it's been clear for a while now that he has used Taylor for relevance, such as when he name dropped her in multiple songs, including his most recent album, when Taylor has never even mentioned him in a song. Kanye also addressed rumors that him and his wife Bianca were kicked out of the Super Bowl, adding, I didn't get kicked out of the Super Bowl, we left our seats to go to YG's box and see my different friends, my wife had never been to a Super Bowl so I wanted to walk around and have a nice time and we had such a fun day. Celebrity insider and critically acclaimed actress Jessica Chin King said the following, This post is such a hot mess, I don't even know what to say about this one. And while, uh, while I agree, here we go, it's the Swifties against the Westies. It's like a modern day West Side Story. And while only one of these fan bases aren't fueled by complete hatred and misogyny, they're both fueled by hilarious comments. And I'm here to present you with my favorite segment, Perspectives with Pepe, where I, Pepe, react to you, my favorite comments from the internet. Here we go. How can they hate the man that made Taylor famous? I can't understand it. How can anybody hate anybody? Taylor said it best. Haters gonna hate, hate, hate. I'm just gonna shake, shake, shake. Yo, Taylor, I'm really happy for you. I'ma let you finish, but Beyonce had one of the best videos of all time. Now that is poetic. Someone should quote this, write it down, or, or use it in a real life scenario, like, like, like an award ceremony or something. And my personal favorite, you gotta read it with his new lisp. Let's do it. I've been banned from hotel, kicked out of companies, and not even allowed to eat in home, in some restaurant. Yeah, that was pretty fun. Are you team yay or team swifty? Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. As always, I'm sure you will anyways, so I don't even need to tell you. Me? I'm team entertainment, and recently this man has got me reaching for the popcorn.